We are just two days away from the Grammys. Many of the nominees are starting to make their way to Los Angeles if they don't already live there. Yes, <laughs> if that. Brightside's Jabari Thomas caught up with a local nominee before heading out to the big show, the lead singer of Tampa Zone, Under Oath. So would you consider yourself like a rock band or heavy metal? I would say we're, we're a heavy rock, hard rock band. It doesn't seem like yeah. you're a hard rock type of guy. Yeah. It's a big time for you because you were nominated for a song, yeah, yeah. and you, uh, you and your band, you broke up, you came back, you wrote a new album. Tell me about this new album and the song that you were nominated for. I didn't think we'd ever make music again. You know, like we've been going for like ten years. This is like high school kids, basically, right after high school. You know, we had this ten-year anniversary coming up on "Define the Great Line," which was came out in 2006. So in 2016, right before then, we started talking about maybe playing a show which led into conversations of a tour, which we did a reunion tour. And on that tour, me and Aaron, our drummer, we started talking about like, this is stupid that we don't, why aren't we doing this? You know, this, this, this is what we do. It's in your blood. Yeah, this is like, we're good at this, this is what we're meant to do, we're having fun. Like, so long story short, me and Aaron started writing and then waited for the rest of the band to be like, all right, let's make a record. I'm like, good, because we already got about 10 songs. <laughs> Tell me a little bit about the, the song that you guys were nominated for. The, the, we were nominated for a song called All My Teeth, which is really cool because we actually wrote that song in the studio. We came back from dinner and just it just started just going. And the four of us really got in there on this record, like old school style of Under Oath, and, like, and working together and not fighting through it like we used to, which was sick. You're nominated for a Grammy. It's a big deal. A big what deal. is the next step? Well, we leave for the Grammys on Saturday. Yay. Yeah. We're Take all me going. with you. Yeah. <laughs> you want to come? I'll go, yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, it, which is wild because, you know, there was not even a thought. It's not like, oh, you're considered for a Grammy or whatever it is. You just, we just woke up like, what? And that, it's just a, a wild thought. And it's never been like a goal or anything, but it is very flattering. And to me, it's encouraging because. It, it means that the Academy isn't paying attention. They're like, we're doing something, you know what I mean? Which is, bands like us, 10 years ago, we wouldn't get in touch with a 10-foot pole. Congratulations for your nomination. Thanks, man. Best it. of luck to Thank you, you in you. Uh, Los Angeles. And uh, rock on. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Under Oath is nominated for Best Metal Performance. Best of luck to yeah, them. And remember, luck. yeah. You can watch the Grammys hosted by Alicia Keys this Sunday at 8 o'clock right here on CBS and 10 News, followed by 10 News Nightside.